I prefer really not to um, not to speak. If I speak, I am in, in big trouble. In big trouble. And I don't want to be in big trouble. Turn me up, kid Spiral. See, I don't know all that, right, yeah? I don't want to be doing rash for apologies. Oh, we're loyal, yeah? Yo. It's a prank. Should I, should I sit up here? No, I think see, bring, bring her close like, towards and you can lean back a bit. Yeah, you'll be alright there. I'll pick you up. Yeah, yeah, there. You're alive there, yeah? yeah. You think you would have let the madame sit on the chair, no? Yeah, hating so bad, isn't it? Like, hating <laughs> yeah. so bad. Like, he's stingy. Yeah. He I've been driving, chair. like, I need to, I need to chill. No, like. he ran to the chair. Do you not have cushions for me, no? Cushion for my ass. man. He's man's studio. Yeah, but I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm taller I'm than man. you, so if I was sitting on that, it would just. No, it, it's the same so thing. you're such a diva, bro. No, but hating so bad how my hands are here. Like, I look at me like I'm actually skinny. Do you know that, same, man? Think what, are we live as well, yeah? Oh, are we? Oh, we're live, yeah. Can I, have a, can I have one taba? Huh? One. You want to take my taba? Just one. Hating so bad how you... I didn't so you come to the studio... Oh, can you just speak English, I swear? Yeah. <laughs> There's a microwave in there. Don't lie, you're bad. It's <laughs> TikTok language, man. Ciao, oh, <laughs> Nassani. <laughs> no, don't violate. That's actually my tab. I haven't ate tab in a minute. Oh, yeah, just I'm gonna have one. You know what I mean, like. No, you said put it in a plate. Yeah, is it you from? You're Nigerian, eh? Of course. Tab or suya? Suya. Stop, man. What even is tab? <laughs> <laughs> what the young one's bringing? What's it's her name? Go, it's goats me. Fiance. You know, one makes the clothes. You know, she makes clothes. You know, one? yeah. Beyonce. Yeah, Qualdo. Do you not see Qualdo? No. Oh, come. Oh, that's her thing. I seen that. Show me. No, show me after. I'll see. Cause I'll see. I I need to do um. Well, she's just tops and all, is it? No, like she's hard. Like she makes proper clothes. Like. Milamba. Yeah. Okay, but I said clothes, so why do you have to have <laughs> Lingala? No, I actually. No, Congolese people. Like, uh, bro, please, no Congolese on this thing. Nah, no, no, Lingala, you mean as well. Trust, you're going to hear him. You're <laughs> nah, going to hear Dongo say it. Even if I do, even if I do, I'll, um, I'll translate. But listen, boys and girls, welcome to season five, If I Speak podcast. Before I introduce my lovely guests, who are apparently in last minute last night on Snapchat and Instagram. Um, I just want to say welcome back. Obviously, a bit of a breather. Took a bit of a break. It not to be that long, but look, outside is outside. Life is life in. Um, I hope everyone's had a brilliant summer. Um, me, myself, you know me. We come up here, we be honest, authentic and real. It's been tough. But through this journey, obviously, there's going to be things where that, that has happened to me that I'll touch in on a little bit that what I can and obviously take us through this journey that I've been on and just let you, man, know, like, you know, you don't give up, you keep fighting, you keep going. Um, I always say this, like, there's always going to be darkness in periods of your life, but I always say there's a little bit of light at the end of that tunnel, keep going forward because that's 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 your hope, you know what I mean? And I'm coming out to the other side, so I have a big announcement towards the end of this show as well. Um, it's a major announcement, boys, yeah? Um, my guests here, these are going to be the first people as well. Oh, yeah, you're doing it. Like, yeah. yeah, I'm going to do it live out today at the end, yeah, so you are going to be like the... The first episode as well that's gonna be on Spotify. So we're on Spotify this season, boys and girls. I'm showing out behind the scenes. You know what I mean? Like so, it's gonna drop. It's gonna be ah, huh? yeah. Oh, you need to do the audio. All right, go on, do it, do it, do it. Fuck it, fuck it. Sorry, sorry. So yeah, without further ado, we got Celine in the building. I'm Mr. Young Giz. What's the crack, boys and girls? What's, what's happening? Hi. Yeah. How I want to kick this off, right? So obviously, Celine, I was talking to you last night, and you were like, uh. Oh, yeah, I'll do it, I'll do it, and all. Let me just show my hair there, which I hear is looking lovely, by the way. Thank you. <laughs> um, and then you go, oh, get his on, get his on as well. So, what I'll, I'll open this, this, this question in with is like, talk to me about you man's friendship, like how you man met and stuff. And how, cause I didn't know you man were friends like this, so chat to me. How did we become friends? I don't even remember I don't, myself. I actually, I can't remember. Hating how you put me on the spot. Yeah. 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 Ah, what do you mean? You're friends now. Yeah, what do you mean? Hating the put do you know what I'm Can I tell you something, right? Some of my friends, let me not I'll make you man awkward. I'm just being honest. Yeah. A lot of my female friends, probably one or two, mm. I moved to them. <laughs> <laughs> I moved to them. I, 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 I failed miserably. Yeah, 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 <laughs> but we're mates now. Do you know what I mean? So how did you, yeah. man? Like, was it like instant music? I think it's because or... of music. Would you say it's because of music? No, we've, mutuals, oh, we've yeah, always mutuals. known. Yeah, we've always known each other, but we got closer because <laughs> of music. <laughs> I, Come on, just, just, just look, look. Can you see that steam coming off this? Yeah. <laughs> Is that all the taba? That's all the taba, bro. No, don't even. I want you all of it. I want you all of it. Go on, but how, how do you want me? Like, I think it was True Mutuals, like you said. Mm. True Mutuals, and then I think music brought us closer. Mm. Yeah. Just motives and stuff like that as well. Yeah. And you was like, see what each other is like, see in this game, like obviously I'll have like, obviously David, we chop up all the time, he's in, in production. I chat to Snow, Ness. Do you guys kind of like, 
we'll see each other, yeah, give yeah, each other yeah, pointers. Yeah, What's that relationship like as well through that? Like, like stuff? we'd ring each other yeah. every like. Because I'm more lazy, so she'd be like. Ringing him, yeah. be like, "Is what so, you doing? Like, what's so. the next move? Like, what are you gonna do now? Do you get me? Yeah. What's your next move? Them yeah. type of conversations." Why you? Why you lazy, bro? Chat to me about that. Why you lazy? I'm not even lazy. You know, like the music thing. You know how it is, bro. Like, yeah. obviously, if you're not seeing results and stuff like that, yeah. it's just it can get long. That's the thing, bro. You have to see what see what you know what we do. Yeah, I was talking to Lindums the other day. Literally yesterday, I think it was. I was watching there. Cause me, like I always say, with, with, with everything that I invest myself into, I have to be like a student of the game. Yeah. Which, like, I'm not just gonna like I come up here. I'm just doing recording with you guys. Yeah. I'll watch other podcasts. So I watch man who are higher than me, man on the same level, my peers. I watch everyone. And I study everyone, even my football. Mm. Like obviously, when we did the tournament. <laughs> man, I laughed at me, yeah, but no, yeah. that, that's what I do. I used I used to watch like. Steven Gerrard, I loved him. I'd watch videos of him. What's he doing? What can I add to my games? You get me? Mm. I'd watch like preseason videos, training. I proper invest myself into things. You get me? Yeah. And one thing that you, when you hear, when you, one thing you should do is like a voice for you, or you guys. Don't just like, you know, obviously you're talented. I listened to you earlier, your, your biceps thing. Yeah. And obviously, Selena, obviously, know you through obviously family and stuff. And I know you're talented as well. But the thing is with, with that is don't just rely on your talent. Study other great people. Don't have to be in your field. Yeah. It could be like basketball. What's LeBron James saying? How does he prepare? How does Ronaldo prepare? How does fucking even Connor? As, as much as Connor's fallen off badly, yeah. I've watched this documentary. He was still I, there, though. Bro, I've watched this documentary about five different times because like his story is so amazing. You get me? And it gives me hope, fellas from down the road, bro. You know what I mean? You can go down to his pub. He's probably there. Do you know what I mean? Doing what I'm doing on a blade Tuesday, drinking. Do you get me? Yeah. <laughs> do you know what I mean? It's so mad, though. like it's so inspiring. So that's what you need to do just to get out of that funk. Don't see results now, but trust me, bro. They'll come. Even me starting this, I started this doing like lives on fucking Instagram, bro. doing like you know random people singing. Oh, that's, that's how I started. Yeah, that's how I started. And I was doing interviews. Boom. He came on a, a, a live one day. We're talking about fucking relationships and all that. Mm. Went on his podcast, went viral. Now we're here sitting with you guys. You know what I mean? Like, so, yeah. So, with, with, with laziness, it's, listen, not every day now you're going to be motivated. Some I wouldn't days, say lazy. It's just yeah. like the motivation isn't always there. That's yeah, what I'm saying. Yeah. yeah. How would I'm, you get yourself out of that funk though then? Like, I don't know. It just kind of happens. Yeah, it just happens. It just kind of happens like that. It just it's, happens. It's not as if I do anything in particular. Like, I'd be doing other things, obviously, and then well, back on music again. That's how it is. Grand. So how how I normally warm up my guests, right? So there's going to be two little sections that I might do if you guys aren't watching what I'm watching, right? So it's what's the gig, so what's, what's the story? It's a little warm up before we get into our conversations about you, get to know you, and you're story. So are you man watching the world? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. yes. Only on TikTok, though. Yes. I actually only watch it on TikTok. Ah, you only watch on TikTok? Yeah, I don't watch it like. Yeah, TikTok be It's a bit too it. cringy to watch it like, you know, for the 60 minutes or cringy. however. Cringy. So just, Bro, just, it's live. No, but I just look at the good parts. <laughs> I like, think this I is the wanna... best Love Bro, Island. Listen, chat to ever. me. Yeah, talk to me. I, I know you're active, Celine. Oh, no. Talk to me about Ty. See what it is. I feel That's like Ty. Ty is the guy. Ty is definitely boys in our generation today. And we're watching them on TV. Like, I thought I was watching one of my situationships on the TV. I'm not even joking. Listen, like. yeah, yeah. A yeah. <laughs> couple of my boys are like that. See, I'm loyal FC, so I don't do any of them things there, but I am. Um, trust Yeah. Trust me, trust me. Well, nah, come here. What, before we even get into Ty and all that, obviously, we, we had a, an Irish person in there, Catherine. Mm. How do you think she, she fared? Because let me kick it off a little bit, right? Obviously, at start, by default, we're going to support her because she's Irish. Yeah, of course. Lovely, boom, lovely. We support Dami, yeah, one day, lovely. Mara, not so much. She's on the, the Mundilla side. We don't really care for that, too. Greg, as well. We don't care about that man there. But, mm. like, Catherine, yeah, one day, Dami, we supported him, yeah? Yeah. Went in there, we supported her. She's grand, it was all right, blah, blah, blah. Went to the casa. She started moving crazy. Like, dating this Elam guy that's saying they're, they're building empires. I'm like, the only empire they're building is an extension in Anu's yeah, kitchen. Right. not building no empire. You know what I mean? Like she was doing so well. That's the sad thing. She was thing. mental. Yeah, she, what, she, you, what, what was your take? What was your take on her? Oh, hating. You were hating, right? No, hating how you said that right now, but like. <laughs> <laughs> well, wait, no, talk to me. Let's let's oh, debate. Hate, let's talk. Hating how you're fully honest. I hate so bad how you just said that. But uh, obviously, I feel like um, her going in. I mean, oh, I was I'm mad. I'm only mad right now. Who made this? You. <laughs> this is. Wow. Go ahead. Sorry. Go. On. It's so bad. Wow, boy. Go on. Like. I don't know, like, I don't know what to say about, she was doing very good, you know. I mm. just feel like she ended up not doing too well towards the end. Mm. Do you get me? But, like, she could have done a lot better. It's a lot of accountability how she treated Scott. She don't, yeah. she don't do it. Yeah. I feel like the way that tr uh, Scott was Can't treated, was, it wasn't, it was so Like, she, he's still go for it. He, he, oh, listen, there's a debate, right? I don't so know what your opinion is on it, is, right? How would you deal with situations? Hey, everyone's talking about you and your board, right? Mm. 
Would you round people up and say, hey, Roy, what's the gig? Who's nah, talking? Nah, right? Never you done. wouldn't do that. Nah, oh, nah. they hated it. Obviously, Should I just pull the man then? Should just pull the man then? He really backed there, I can't lie. I like, still rate really it, but I wouldn't there. do that because I don't really care about their opinions. It's me and my girl at the end. Yeah, but for him to do, mm. but for him to do that in a place that they were, that's, that's yeah, yeah, a lot, yeah, yeah, do you know yeah, what yeah, I mean? Yeah. Mm. Like, in the sure. place that they were, that's a lot. But. And then the fact that he stayed loyal in Casa as well. Obviously, look, he was, obviously, he had a little look, which you do. You know what I mean? Just because you're on a diet doesn't mean you can't look at the menu. 100%, 100%, just down the order. You know what I mean? Have a little look, have a little scope, right? He's like, nah, not for me. Exactly. I want Catherine. And then, she goes off and she's bleeding. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it's crazy. What what I thought was mad though, right? Because you, you know, on, I don't know if you man are on Twitter. <laughs> I see the demographic on Twitter, right? And it's like, there's two communities that you can't go for. Black women and LGBTQ plus <laughs> Volkswagen Polo. Right? <laughs> you, can't, <laughs> you can't come for them, man, because if you come for them, you're dead, you're finished, right? Yeah, I won't lie. Facts. When, bla- when I seen black people turning around, I was black men, of course I was thinking, ah, oh, here come the... Black men don't love black women. Yeah, you, get, man, you, you know can't even like, say nothing. And if you say hey, anything, you brother, get black women torn on her, bro. Yeah. Yeah. That's when she was even, done. Yeah, even your one day, bro. Even your one oh, day. Did what? Did the she? one day torn. She was like, yeah, you're moving crazy. Damn. You get? And then, like, Dami was, <laughs> Dami got cooked. Dami was tweeting. He was tweeting. He was always like, you know what? Celine, you're a fashion girl, right? You're wearing bleeding, bubble bleeding, chat. Don't eyes, come yeah? for my bubble. Don't what do you think? What do you think of her clubber? She was getting a lot of stick for her clubber as well. What do you think of her clubber? They were saying she was going on like Michelle Obama. Like, you know what is? I feel like <laughs> yeah. I feel like it was okay. Go on Twitter, man. Oh, no, bro. guys. What are you laughing oh, at, man? I feel like it was it was okay. You can't do that. It was okay. She's twenty. What is she? She's twenty three. But you know, some people just have that about them. Like that's just how they go about. Do you not think so? Chris. Literally, everyone has their own different. Yeah. 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 So he was giving her a bit of stick over that, and then she was getting a bit of stick over all this stuff. But I just felt like, look. She I feel have, like what it was as well, mm. everyone was picking on her with everything now because of the way she's already came out in the after the Casa Moore situation. Everyone's just looking for anything to say about her, but mm. oh, like she lacked. I can't, I she can't did, even. She yeah, did. She, she lacked no, her. she, she did. Even her own, fri- with Scott. her own friends were tweeting as well. They didn't want this alum guy, do you get me? And even at the end, towards the end, do you remember the episode where he's like, he just came out to him, he's like, look, I'm a bit too much, we're stale or something on board. That made no sense. I'm waiting for a bombshell. Right. I'm thinking, brother. That made no sense. Do you know sense. what this girl is going through online and you're waiting for someone else yeah. to come in, do you get me? Yeah. And then they live, the two ticks live, and then a bombshell comes in. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, literally. fucking clown. But, um, Ty, talk to me about Ty. Chat Ty. to me. First of all, Ty is gorgeous. Abby? Yeah, he's gorgeous, first mm-hmm. of all. Second of all, I feel like he's literally boys in our generation today on TV in display. Like, do you get what I'm trying to say? Like, do you feel like... Do like you feel what? like you correlate with Ty in any way? Like, nah, 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 no, 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 no. Well, you're a so good boy. You're not yeah, hundred percent. Like, yeah. Have you got a girl now? Nah, but like, obviously. <laughs> 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 nah, I wouldn't say I have a girl or anything, but like, I'd rather just speak to one person than be juggling girls around. That's what I'm mm. trying to say. But I wouldn't make that person my girlfriend if I'm not ready. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But like, obviously. Well, ju- when you're single though, mm. that's all right, no? Like, yeah. No, nah, it is. It is. It is. It is. But like. I'm not one to be like just sleeping around. Like I'd rather just have that one girl that like I go back to. Yeah, you'd rather mm-hmm. keep it real. And we have that rather than just, you get me? See, that's very rare <laughs> to find. No, no, but why are you looking laughing? around? You said you'd rather keep it real. <laughs> Some people out here are being soaked, man. It's fucked. Yeah, <laughs> it's fucked for it, yeah? It's fucking yeah. mental. Yeah. You know what I mean? We had, we had a phase like 2018 when we was bleeding, dripping, yeah? Come here. Um, <laughs> we'll move on. <laughs> we'll move on from Love Island, yeah. I want to chat to you quickly. Um, I knew you man follow that uh, celebrity boxing the weekend. Yeah, I've seen actually. What do you man think? Remind uh, me of who again? Is obviously no, I seen I seen your me. boy uh, Kiefer, is it? Kiefer, yeah, that's oh, my boy. Yeah. Yeah. He did his yeah, thing. He did his yeah, thing. He did his thing. I'm like, I wasn't sure about that because obviously it's boxing. He's an MMA fighter, isn't mm, so mm. nah, he done well though. I can't lie. Yeah, Kiefer, he's. Well, the thing with him, he's just with fighters, yeah, they're just they're mentally just not normal people, you get me? So he's gonna go in there, he's not he's not coming out there without a victory, you get me? Mm-hmm. All the three Irish lads won, came won as well. Mm. Um and then obviously this I is don't the, even want to talk about the Ben one, bro. Yeah, I, I wanna to touch on it briefly, right? Listen, again, so another thing that I learned, obviously when 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 I'm off, I always gonna analyze my previous seasons and what I can work on, what I can do better. Yeah. I listen to million dollars worth of game as well. They're doing very well, them lads are as well. I think they're like the most gross earning um, podcast in America. Uh, the Auburn yeah. one. Lad Wallow came out of jail and stuff and they're very motivating, they're very inspiring. 
And with me, when I first started, people were like, where's the funny Dongo? He was getting me smiley, he was getting my man he was smiley managing me, he was getting, Dongo's not being funny, that what is Dongo doing? I'm like, if you watch my lives, if you go on my Instagram page, watch my lives, I'm talking to Tyam, Sani Fitness, Ava, mm. it's getting their stories and what you're doing and where you're trying to go, blah, blah. So that's why I came on the podcast doing that. Obviously, I incorporated a bit of banter as well, yeah. blah, 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 do you get me? But one thing that the boys touch on, which I want to do as well, I don't, and I normally do it, right? And we spoke about it earlier. Normally when people come from me, I'm like, siege mentality, right? fuck everyone. I'm going to, when I come on a podcast, I'm going to say, fuck you, fuck you, what? Who wants it? You know what I mean? Like, yeah. I don't want to be like that anymore. If I have an opinion on a situation, I'm still going to voice my opinion and see what people can do better. I.e. Yeah. promoters, motives, nightclubs, my own game here, whatever it is that we need to talk about, you get me? Yeah. But I want to be a person that, like you two are probably the youngest guests I've probably had, you get me? And it's, especially as a Congolese lad, a lot of us here does, that are, have had platforms hmm. have embarrassed the community. Do you get me? And I, I embarrassed, feel embarrassed. Would you say embarrassed? Oh. You're gonna make me talk how I don't want to talk, bro. <laughs> what would you say embarrassed? Yes, though? That's a big word, though. I don't. There, I don't think it's, it's like that. Okay, embarrassing. Do you know what? I'm taking it back. Embarrassing is probably too strong of a word, yeah. but that haven't really. You've had a platform, but you're not really like, you know, putting on a good like path for the okay, youth. Yeah, 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 Where yeah, you're, yeah, yeah. I've heard about people being arrogant. I've heard about people like. Gossiping, it's like, what are you doing? You get me? You're, you're supposed to be. I'm doing this to open other laneways for kids. You get me? Where 13, 14, or 15 year old that's looking up to me, that's could be Congolese or whoever. Yeah. Oh, I don't have to go to school or whatever. If this starts making money or whatever, there's a laneway there. You get me? People from my communities, I want to be showing more love. You get me? So, this is the last thing I want to touch on this, this fucking Fabio D fella. It's like, <laughs> why, are you, why are you going in there knowing you can't scrap, bro? You know what I mean? Like, and even with me, people want me to deal with and all that. I don't Personally, even want, I I like, don't want I him as an opponent like, anymore. I feel like you should have. Yeah, no, but it was a last oh, minute thing, and obviously Ben, Ben's name is huge in this, yeah. in what he does, do you know what I mean? So okay. obviously he probably crazy. picked him as an opponent, Yeah, because Fabi has called him up before. They must have known that he couldn't fight, though, that's yeah. what yeah. I don't, like, come on. Like, watch Skechers. Like, come on, like, it was like, what, 30 seconds or something? 30 seconds, like I, 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 I was talking Stop to Ben sketches. on the phone, I was talking, sorry, love, you can close that, they don't want to be chilling on the podcast. Um, I rang Ben earlier, that day. I said, he was hitting two shots, bro, and it'd be over, and it was two shots and it was over. <laughs> Fucked, bro. <laughs> Fucked. Yeah, it's, it's just annoying to see. Have you seen the, the the new charity match coming up though? Created an errors one. Yeah. Oh, um, <laughs> what is they got? Vicky's fighting uh, Mick and uh, Jay Ronick are fighting. Yeah, I seen that one. Jay Ronick and that Mick. Yeah, Vicky right. definitely gonna do her big one. Yeah, can Vicky grab? She's gonna do her big. Oh, one. there's a girl <laughs> one too. <laughs> she's gonna do her big one. Yes, sir. There's a girl yeah. one too. Girl, like, Vicky against yeah. some blonde girl. I don't know what her name is, but don't Vicky's fighting. Oh yeah. Yeah, and then uh, Mick is fighting Mick. The I think he's like the CEO. Yeah, yeah. I seen that one. Him and Jay Ronick. What's the housing? That one's gonna go. I don't really know like either of them like that, but yeah. I actually don't know. I, that's like the first time that somebody's doing that in like our type of, not industry, but you know, like. No, I see it. Yeah, yeah, it's our thing. Yeah, yeah, it's our thing. So, yeah, I don't know. See. Just back on that as well, right? I, do, do you guys believe in like, obviously, I was even, I put on my Snapchat today, yeah? And uh, there's a lad, there's a Muslim lad, and um, he was like, he was like, uh, nah, don't go, don't say like it was manifesting like, the word, the power of the brain. He said like, that can kind of block your blessings because this all this comes from God, you get me? Yeah. So if you look at my caption with Fabio D, I was like, and people laughed at, at the start where I was like, oh, I'm going to fight you in the tree arena, I'm going to sell out and all this, yeah? Mm. But I ended up manifesting it for him. Oh, yeah, true. Which it was still, I feel like I still manifested it, but it was like, it was for you, you get me? Do you yeah. guys believe in that manifestation? Yeah. I don't know. I don't yeah, know. sometimes. I don't know if I believe in it, I can't lie. I haven't yeah, looked I into it enough to... Do you get me? Like people. So do you not, do you not nah, speak something, believe, believe in it, and then it happens, and you think, oh, oh you, man, you, you don't believe in it, no? I just believe about like working nah, I hard, str- like, I strongly just work hard. Do you get me? I don't believe about nah, of saying course, something of course, and it's just going to happen. No, of course like, you work hard, but when you speak, when you're speaking it, oh, yeah, and speaking into existence, yeah, yeah, and it happens, then yeah, you have there's no you have no choice but to believe that you're you manifest it into it. You look back and you're like, yeah, it's even 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 with what I'm going to announce later, I'll talk about that at the end. It's like I kind of. When I was there the other day, like I looked, everything that I saw that day, it was like I visioned it in my head, you get me? Mm-hmm. Even my home, I speak about my home as well. I was talking to you earlier about it, Celine, where I was kicked out um, with my ex back in my ma's, and obviously they were building new apartments. And I was bringing my daughter home to my ma, because she lives right across from me. And I was just like, I said to her, I was like, I don't know how we're going to do this child, but we're going to live there. I don't know how I'm going to do it, but we're going to live there. It was a time where COVID as well. At home, you know what I mean? Like, it's no gal, no nothing, you know what I mean? You're earning the doll as well because you're not walking. Yeah. Tough. But I was visualising in my head me sitting there with her watching the football and stuff like that, you get me? Mm. And that has all happened as well. There's a lot of things that I've called. A lot of things that I've called, like, I've called a lot of shit, you get me? Yeah. But obviously, I do believe also because obviously I am, like, you know, I pray as well and I, yeah. I ask God for things and guidance and I, believe, I also believe that too, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. so, yeah. Move for that, bleeding. 
Lean hard fell store. Yeah, kind of, that was kind of <laughs> deep, bro. Yeah. <laughs> it's what's about this thing, bro. You're, you're going to laugh. You'll probably cry. You'll get deep. This is this my podcast. But come here, Celine, let me start with you, right? So this is how I always start with, with my guests. Just your, I know you're young. What age? You're, 19, you're 20 now, was it? 19. 19. Feck. You need to wish your age. Um, your introduction into music, so getting into the music scene. Talk to us about that, your early days. I know a lot of times where I talk to artists, They've all started in church. Was that the same with you or would you just... No, my foster mum is the one who put me into music. Mm. So I feel like everyone has their own ways of getting through stuff. Like some people go to the gym. Yeah. Some people go to... I don't know what you do. Like some mm. people drink. Some people do different things to get over whatever it is. Mm. So obviously they're trying to find what is that suits me in it. So they put me into Gaelic, not me. Like I'm not someone that plays football. Mm. Put me into flipping. What else? They put me ballet. Not my thing. Put me into acting, dancing, and singing. And they're saying that I was taking more like singing ways. Like whenever I'm sad over something, I'm what I'm doing is trying to make a song. Do you get me? Like I'm leaning more into the music side in it. Mm. So obviously, that's how I got into it. Mm. Just the foster people. Yeah, they put my foster family. They put and me see into it. rap then, because obviously rap is is it's, a, it's different. Yeah, it's, it is yeah. different. It's not like you're you're singing like you know projecting your voice and stuff like that. You're proper. You're barring. You're spitting. What was your force kind of like? Introduction into rap, were you writing? Was it like you listening to it? How how did you get into that? Poems, like poems, yeah. Poems. The so rhyming, ba- the rhyming. I could be like, I'm the type of person where like, like I was saying to Dave earlier, I was telling him like, when someone's arguing with me, now I just like take it in, yeah. So there's not not what else am I supposed to do? Do you get me? Mm. So I just write it down, make poems that are writing, like whatever I'm hurting, whatever is hurting, or whatever I'm feeling pain, I'm just writing it down, writing it down, writing it down. And then sooner or later, I just said, let me just rap, put on a beat. And yeah, when yeah. I was younger, literally. And how, and see, being like, <clears throat> there's not many years, like in the industry, like, I know people don't like calling it industry, let's call it the scene, because industry, yeah. because we're not making money, you can't call it the industry, yeah, yeah. So we'll call it the scene. Hmm. So how have you found it, like, you know, being as a woman, a young woman as well, you're very young, like being in the scene, how have you found, like, how have your peers been with you? Do you get a lot of good feedback? Does people like, like no, rooting get, for you? I get. So how have you found that? Because sometimes you see, you know, when you hear with women are doing stuff with, like yeah, no, there's been the good, a little bit, yeah, good feedback. Like, I feel like I've been getting a lot of more good things then, but then a lot of hate comes in as well mm. randomly. Like, but obviously, if you're not getting any hate, then you're not doing it right. You get me? Mm. But obviously, I don't know. Like being a girl in the Irish like scene, black as well, young. I feel like it's harder. I do feel like it's harder, do you get me? Mm. Like 110%. But it's really about who you surround yourself with, mm. do you get me? But I don't know, like it's hard, but it's lit. Let me unpack something me? that you said just a little bit, right? Um, mm. Because you, like, you were giving, you, you were very like passionate there earlier on when you were talking to me about like how you deal with like, well, for me, how to deal with stuff and stuff like that. Because mm. obviously the level where I'm going and how it's grown, because sometimes like I'm very, thing with me, right? I'm, I'm two things, I can be very smart, I'm very street smart and I, I see everything, but I'm very stupid as well and naive. Because even stuff that has happened in my life the last couple of months, I'm so, if I was to let you man know what happened and how, how I look at myself and then how I just let this, like it was right in front of my face and I didn't fucking see it. It's so annoying, do you know what I mean? Like, But how do you deal with, you said you talk about hate and stuff like that. How do you deal with that? How do you cope? Like, it was me, I'm just like, right, let's have a knock. Well, <laughs> that's not the way to do it. <laughs> that's not, not, but how, how, do you, how do you deal with it? How would you do it? And what, what type of hate comes your way, by the way, actually? TikTok. It's just TikTok. Ah, don't worry. Listen, I'll let, I'll let you land for it. I'll let you land for it. Like girls, you land. Yeah. girls come in. Do you know when you're doing something that other people aren't doing? Mm. Then I feel like that's when, or when you're not quiet, you're not quiet, you're very loud. That's when you get a lot of hate from yeah. people that you wouldn't even be expecting to yeah. be getting hate from. Yeah. Um, how I deal with it is just, I won't lie, like, if you don't have people to talk to, then it's the longest day for you. But that's how I deal with stuff, speaking to my siblings or people that are around me. Mm. More time talking to them or just making making a track, literally just writing it down. It sounds hard. And for me, making a track and it's sounding hard, I'm like, yeah, that's my way of dealing with it. Do you get me? Mm. Literally. Mm. Like, that's for, the way to do it. For me, it should only matter the opinion of your team and you. Do you get me? Because yeah. they're the ones that are going to be the real Everyone with you. says that, but you, you're going to feel what No, I are hear saying. it. See, with you me, boy, let me not lie to you yet. TikTok, trust me, I've been, I'm, I'm on there. I talk Sharon today about this all the time. Don't mind TikTok. TikTok is full of jobless people who are hiding behind fucking fake pages. A lot of fat people that are fucking eating cheeseburgers every day that don't know what they're doing. They're just hating or just to hate, you get me? Yeah. Even me, there's, I intentionally piss people off on, t- on TikTok. Do you know how I would piss people off on TikTok? We can sit here and talk about racism right now. And I'll clip it, put it on TikTok. Do you get me? 
like don't mind TikTok, bro. That that, that now there is. I'm not gonna. <laughs> I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna mention the name. There is one artist that gets cooked on TikTok. We'll talk off camera, right? Dave, you probably know what I'm talking. You probably know what I'm talking about, yeah. Yeah, that person deserves it. You need to stop. You know what I mean? Listen, I'm not. I'm not hating, but you're you have bad mates because you're making some money on production. You're making some money on fucking sound engineers and this, this, that, and that. This person can't rap, like point blank. Yeah, mm. calm. But I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't even watch what TikTok saying. So it's just. I remember me. Wait, just so I like know what you're talking about because I feel left out. No, lady, I don't know either. Like. Lady or like man. What? Uh, I, I thought you were going to say name there. Uh huh. It's a bleeding fucking. Lady or a man. What's she? Oh, <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking about? If I speak. <laughs> I actually don't even know. I don't even know. You know. No, I'll, we'll, land, we'll land after, right? I was, <laughs> was going to say, yeah, even me, right? Where it was like, you have to be able to also take constructive criticism. That's, I think, is you'll probably touch on this as well, right? I say it probably comes your way more as a man as well, yeah? You know how man the man, right? Where, like, jealousy and, you know, yeah, the yeah, 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 probably yeah. seeing you going somewhere to, like, try and put you down. I remember I do, I do my first live show, right? Um, it was with Black and Irish. We did the Who Was the Main Character. I absolutely, I don't know what I was doing up there. I was mentioning my kids. I was jumping around like a fucking clown. But sometimes I, I needed that because obviously I've hosted for um, two artists, Joel and uh, Smiles, for their um, listening parties. Oh, and yeah, so yeah, like, right, I'm not yeah. there to be the funny guy. Mm. You're here to present. Yeah, like Ness always says to me, People should not notice that you've done a good job, you get me? They shouldn't notice. You're just doing your job. It's, about, it's not about you, it's about them, you get me? Okay, yeah. Where uh, there was criticism from my peers, which I'd rather don't come say it to my face, but that's that's neither here or there. Okay. David was the one that gave me constructive criticism. Like, listen, your stage presence is good, this, that, and that, but you just need to present the show. You're doing like more too much gimmicks, trying to be too funny. And I rate that. Say it to me face, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. I can take, yeah, that's you real. Need, I can you, take, need you can take constructive criticism. I play football, bro, mm. you know what I mean? Like, mm. you need constructive criticism. And I feel, but sometimes ass. <laughs> Especially here in Ireland, right? We'll talk about, I'm not going to talk about UK and all that. Because they have the problem over there. Mimi, the music blogger, was tweeting about it a while ago, saying about um, she doesn't do reviews anymore because people are too sensitive. Okay? You can't critique people. People like be tweeting you and they make embarrassed about you or whatever. Do you get me? So I feel like in Ireland, like if you if I, if I say something now about an artist, say like, oh, that wasn't it. Best believe I'm getting, I'm getting a phone yeah, call yeah, yeah, or I'm yeah. getting a message or majority someone might even pull up here. Guys, do you get me? So how are you with, when you hear criticism towards your name? How are you with that? I don't really are you care. all right? Nah, I just don't care. Like, I've yeah. been in the game, like, long enough. Obviously, there's still, like, another step to go. Like, mm. I probably haven't even witnessed as much as I will witness. Mm. But for now, now nah, I'm good. Like, I don't... Yeah. And, and you know, it's okay to kind of... People are... Listen, like, then I always say this, yeah. Opinions are not facts. Yeah. People are allowed to have their fucking opinion. It's like, it's like people... Everyone has a... Like, it's like everyone has an arsehole, right? Opinions are like assholes. Everyone fucking has one. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> as the Irish. It's the. Nice. the <laughs> it's the Yo, he's gonna use a different example, bro. Like, come on, bro. bro. Come on. It's the Irish in me. I don't give a fuck. Like, opinions are like assholes. Everyone fucking yeah. has one. Do you know what I mean? It's okay to, as well to also challenge people on their opinion. Yeah, it's like, okay, no. It's like people, people come around to me and tell me, oh, Dango, your, your podcast is shit. Oh, it's shit. Check my views. Check my views. Check every single podcast I go on. I, I look at, I look at no even you. That bar says thing, nine point five k uh, views, yeah. more than everybody. Uh, well, obviously, there's more from last yeah, year. Yeah, and all yeah, of course, you, yeah. I think it's twelve days in. You have more views than everybody, right? Yeah. Yeah. Check the views. Check the numbers everywhere I go. People's TikToks numbers go up. So you can call me. Oh, you, you're not good. You're not good. No problem. Numbers don't lie, you know what I mean? I don't give a bollocks. Don't lie. Do you know what I mean? Like, I'm sitting here with Selena Young is. I have people that, I have Gloria's coming on this season. I have JLOL. Yeah, yeah. We don't mind, you know what I mean? I'm even telling people now, right? No, you got big names, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, you yeah. got big names. 100%. But, like, if, if it's okay, it's okay for me to kind of critique you in a sense where I'm like, even even Joel smiles and all that. If, I always, like, even be humble and stuff. Like, we, I always have honest conversations with them, do you know what I mean? Yeah. And even with my family members, I always, like, have honest conversations. I just want honesty around me. Because you, you have an honesty, you grow and you have to be able to accept that as well that's the only way you're gonna fucking grow yeah be your own biggest critic you know what i mean like yeah. one episode that i can't watch back is the congo boy episode i can't watch that i cringe every time i watch why, that why? because wrong? i'm a fucking weapon that's why i let him get into my head you know what i mean like where i'm screaming and shouting and you know what i mean like, but mm. that's that's that was a lot of critique i thought i was like because obviously the only way congo boy is and hanging yeah, these people yeah, and all yeah. that i thought i was like oh yeah lovely people are gonna be on me so nope people are like you're a joke and they were right you get me? So obviously that's where you see the improvements as as the fucking. Obviously uh, you learn from it though. That's the Yeah, one hundred percent and one hundred percent. But yeah, you is yourself. What was your what was your intro into music? When did you start? Uh, stuff? I started. What like made you get into it? Twenty nineteen. Oh. Yeah, I used to play football. Obviously, 
Well, you know, football, it gets to that stage where, like, obviously, you see your mates getting scouted, doing this, doing that. Well, you had mates going abroad, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Touch yeah. me, how, how, me about that. What, what, where where your mates go? I have, like, one of my best friends from young, you know, I don't know if you know, Andrew. Andrew. Oh, yeah, yeah, he's yeah. your boy. Yeah. Ah, he's gonna watch. That's my guy, bro. Oh, yeah. That's my guy, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Been my boy since young. Yeah. Obviously, I used to take him training and stuff like that, and then yeah. I'm seeing him do all of that. It's like, mm. okay, if the football thing isn't working, then I need something else. Yeah. When I started rapping, it wasn't like that. It was just boredom. You know, you get the girls. You get me. It, it looks good, innit? Yeah. But then, yeah, I don't know. That's kind of how I started. Just football wasn't really going my way. I see you with yourself. Obviously, we touched on obviously lack of consistency. We can say not laziness. Yeah, yeah? Yeah, yeah. I always hear this, and I want both just to answer this. Right? I always hear this about artists, and I want you guys, you're like artists, you're young artists as well, to explain. I always hear like it's hard to release music, especially when you're not signed, you haven't got the budget and stuff like that. Yeah? yeah. Just talk to me because obviously everyone wants to be a podcaster, everyone wants to be an artist, and it's our job to kind of let people know this thing. It may look easy on yeah, the eye, but man. even with, like I said, for me to produce quality, you have to do research. You have to do, so I do quick research. I listened to you once, and I was like, yeah, this uh, not once. I heard John Smiley's song outside before, sick quality. Obviously, I already know of Celine and stuff like that. But it's like there's a lot of craft that goes into this game. If you want to get into it, you know what I mean? So talk to me about the process. That's, that's both our songs, by the way. I hate hearing Smiley. Fuck off! It's not only Smiley's song. Kind of like I hate, I hate hearing like. Obviously, that's my boy. Don't get yeah, yeah no, hundred, hundred. But yeah. like, even it out, like I didn't get like rushed. So that was so because usually it's like. Someone featuring someone's song. Nah, there was no. So it's a collab. Yeah, Proper collab. That's, that's a collab. Bro. Fuck that's, off! That's I never no, knew. That's no feature, no nothing. That's a collab, straight up. Man, his name just came first, and I don't mind. I don't. Yeah. Mind. Okay. Good. Why was the film with Mac Williams then? Huh? Was the film on your ends as well? Nah, Mac Williams okay though. Yeah. I don't mind. Like I, that's where my managers were from as well. Oh, okay. So okay. it was like it's all good. Mm. You know what I mean, it's all love. I'm not like I'm not self-centered. I don't mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Do you know, see with that, that's that's a good thing to have as well. I feel like, and you know him as well, Cello. I feel Cello is such a people's person. Yeah, mm -hmm. and I'm not just saying it. Look, I, I it's not see you in this industry. I don't want to just like obviously, oh, he's my mate and all that blah blah. No, I proper chat to him. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And I see him. And like, even little shows, Joel's show, he'll be there. Small shows, he'll be there. Yeah, he's always at everyone's show, and it's he genuinely true. shows that. Yeah. Are like, you like that as well? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like even from the first time I spoke to you, like I yeah. wasn't on no like bougie vibes. Like yeah. I'll laugh with you even if I don't know you. Like yeah, that. yeah, yeah. Well, obviously, if I don't want to talk, I don't want to talk. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah. You give me that vibe though, bro. Yeah, Laid yeah, back. Yeah. I know. I was. I, I was. Yo, go talk though, because I, I didn't think I you'd. I didn't think you'd. You'd. Um. You. You'd be like. Sometimes artists are just uh, laid back and doing the cool boy thing. Nah, nah. But nah, nah. Yeah, go talk. But what? What? I wanted to ask you. Like I said, back to the question. It's like the process of making music and trying to get it out. Talk to me about that. Like the f the money, the studio time, all that. See, how hard me, is to get music for out? For me, it's like the money's not even the problem. Like that's just the start. But it's actually like you know, there's all these other things like marketing, like. That just does my head and I can't lie. Because obviously I'm by myself. I'm independent. So to be like researching all of that, like it's just like, ah, it's all long. That's my main problem. I wouldn't even think about like the money too tough. Like yeah. It will come back. Do you know what I'm trying to say? It's like a boomerang. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that would be my main problem. Just like releasing and like doing it the right way. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Everyone mm -hmm. could just release music, but mm -hmm. there's like a certain type of way you have to do it. I don't know how to explain it, but I feel like you know what I no, mean. No, 100%. Yeah. What about you, Celine? How, do you, how are you feeling with that? Well, as well? for me, I obviously have Ernest out there mm. on my team, and I feel like he's a very good, he guides me very well. So when it comes to the stuff like marketing and all of that stuff, then I have Ernesto to do studio time. He'd be there because he's a engineer himself. So for me, I feel like I've been blessed. Do you get me? Don't have to worry about that stuff, but I feel like, I don't know. I get what you're saying though, because there was a time, there was a time last year before, because there was a time where people, like see the way you're doing the podcast, mm. there'd be load of people that want to do a podcast because of you, but it's not fit for them. So there's load of people that wants to be a manager, but it also was not fit for them. Do you get what I'm trying mm. to say? Mm. Like, mm. so that's it. That's where I was last year. So I understand what he's trying to say. I couldn't do all of that because I feel like, I don't know, there's a way that everything has to be done and then you just don't have serious people around you. Do you get me? Mm. So. I'm gonna get before I get back to my notes, right? Because just something popped in my head as you man were talking, right? Mm. You spoke about earlier. I'm fair, like I like these conversations because obviously there's people. Obviously, you're Celine, you're an artist, you're aspiring to be something in life. But you spoke about having a, a like I know this person because we know each other personally. But it's like, what has what how what impact has that kind of had in your life? Like has that been tough for you, hard for you, or are you just being a foster child? Like you, you spoke about oh. that earlier. How has that been with, with, like, with you with your life? Um, like. Some people get it differently, you know, like fa foster families is not all the same. Like you could be put into a foster family and it's 
not give him prayer. Do you get me? But <laughs> I, I How was. Gonna, we're no, about something like, serious. Nah, I know it's deep, but like you can't prayer. in life. You have to make stuff. Do you get me? That's, yeah, you have to turn it to comedy. I get it. I do all the time. Yeah, like, yeah. yeah. Some <laughs> of them is not giving prayer, but luckily I was put in a place where it felt like a family in it. So mm. obviously, when I was growing up there, it was actually in Cork. I was actually in Cork for oh, like. Oh God bless you. Yeah, I know. We moved from Dublin down back from Blanchard Sound actually to Cork to like country country place and i'm just like bro what is this because i am not with the farm and stuff but mm. obviously when we're there it was calm like but obviously i don't know like it changes you you look at life differently you know not being able to grow up and be able to actually call someone like my whole life i've been haven't been able to call anyone mum and dad like growing up as a kid i'm only starting to call my dad now because we're only rekindling now do you get me mm. but imagine it's your biological father you're yeah, my, dad. yeah yeah so obviously growing up there's no one to call my, everyone's just by their names you get me mm. so i feel like you look you appreciate stuff more like now do you get me like i'm appreciating stuff more now because obviously growing up in that like in that environment i'm obviously not getting stuff that like my friends are like the people around me are getting so like it was deep but i feel like it's made me who i am today mm. Do you get me? Like, I feel like you have to go through stuff to get through it. No, 100%. Yeah. That you're spot on there. There's a follow-up question where you, boy, I asked that because of what you said in your bar session, but just to follow oh, up you on You know, what I said. knew you was going to ask that. Yeah, and oh, I had to. There's two I want to ask you. There's, two, there's one funny one and then there's, there's a deep there's, one. Yeah, there's a deep one as well, right? One. But see where, um, I told you I'm good at this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> right, so see where, where um, with your music though, the, from what I've heard from you, it's like it's real like upbeat songs and blah yeah. blah. But it's upbeat. The beats are upbeat, but yeah. everything I rap about, I'm yeah. spit. I'm actually are you, spitting. Are you projecting it's, on your music? Yeah. Yeah, it's life. Like I'm not rapping about pussy. I'm not talking about like yeah, I, don't I like went that. here and my titties yeah. out. And do you yeah. get me? Like I'm actually it's spitting. Dead. Like dead. I'm spitting. Not dead though. I'm not. Do you get ah, me? It is, man. For, no, 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 listen. No, no. It's not for it's the not, young. It's not, for the young. It's not dead. Like no, 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 no. The the pussy thing. Yeah. For me, I'm not saying that your story, your pain, hardly. Who might who might tell you your story's dead? Am I mad? No, no. <laughs> the pussy thing I'm just like brother for me anyways I like when I'm listening to like I like deep shit like tell me about your pain your struggle I just yeah. love pain music I don't know what's wrong with me I just love it I, lo I like listening to it. even like Joel's tape there that he came out that's about Brookfield where I'm from mm. and I know what was going on back then you know I mean? and that's the struggle and pain being able to project that into music you know what I mean yeah. I love listening to Smiles because Smiles puts the pain into music as well I just like that so obviously there's a time for the little the young, yeah, 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 but I'm not mad into it, you know what I mean? Yeah. I'm 30 years of age, pussy, if I have two kids, I, I won't be listening to that. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I need to be motivated, do you know what I mean? I need to get up and be like, I'm, I'm, on, the, I'm on the Lewis, I'm listening to this, this, that, and that, you're struggling, you're getting out of your struggle. Yeah. I'm listening to that pussy, this pussy, I'm going into the clock and in stress, I'm being, do you know what I mean? Like, don't, it doesn't make, fuck it doesn't that. Up, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't make sense for, for my life. Mm. Now, for other niggas that are young and stuff like that, yeah, it makes sense, but I'm just saying, like, that's where I want to, like, you know, I want to be hearing from. No, but it's still lit though. Project. Only like, like when the pussy stuff. No, when girls like from like let like, who my who's popping right now? Like sexy red. Oh, yeah, yeah, like yeah, that's lit. Do you get me? Mm, 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 but mm, mm, mm. that's not me. Do you get me? Mm. I'm trying to spit about life, but in an upbeat way. Yeah, do you get me? That's I what I'm that. doing. Yeah. Is you? Let me go on to the funny part first, right? Before, <laughs> before I get deep, you yeah. go. You go. What did you say? Eh? I didn't put on my notes. In Zambia, guy. I said, oh my God, is for you. Oh yeah, yeah. chat to me about this bar. Can't find love, but I move mad when I'm horny. No, I said, can't find love, but I move mad when I'm horny. Mm. Because so I was, well, how are you moving when you're, when you're roasting? Nah, because <laughs> obviously, <laughs> obviously like... Because <laughs> <laughs> they're man, bro. Do you know what I'm saying, man? I'm roasting. Nah, nah, you have nah, no nah, options. Nah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. When I say that, bro, I don't say it in the way certain man would. You know what I'm trying to say? Yeah. Like, obviously, I'm still calm and composed, but like, mm. I might not be like, if I had a girl, I might not be as loyal. That's what I'm trying to say. Bobby? Yeah, yeah, but, but obviously. What did you I've, say earlier, though? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, still, yeah, no, yeah. Try to get, 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 get the girls on the side. Don't get yeah. twisted. Yeah. Don't get twisted. I've still never cheated in my life. Only had, Abby? Only had one girlfriend. still never cheated. I'm just talking about me now. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's what I mean by that, though. Mm. All right, cool. Well, you see, you try to get me there. Nah, nah, I'm not going to ask you a question, bro. I just asked you a question. Me, I've already spoke about it. Me, when I, one time I was, I was horny, I was moving mad. What do you mean by moving mad, though? I got a prostitute. Oh. Yeah, never that, bro. <laughs> never that, bro. I won't lie, never that, bro. That's, that's, that's too far, that's bro. That's, like, so yeah. far. 60 quid. Stretch bad. <laughs> Stretch. Wait, what? Nah, 60 bro. euro, like... Five minutes. No, I didn't throw it in or anything like that. It's just, she kicked me out. We're arguing. You argued with a prostitute. How? She had fake chats and she wouldn't let me touch them. She's like, I'm not your girlfriend. I goes, you're bleeding now. I'm about to pay you. I'm your girlfriend for the next half an hour. What, you in Ireland, though? Yeah, Maldron. Oh, 
you're mad. Cross me, tell us to age him. You're crazy, bro. I've showed the man them. Like, the people I've seen TikToks and all, I've showed them, like, they were like, listen, hunting them, COVID. Not, there's no way you're real. What? You can't be listen, real. That's what it is. Fuck it. It's one time I was struggling. I don't know you out. People are saying no. Horny out, rousing. When the Henny hits me, it's not Henny, Jack hits me, it's peak. It's different. Would you not just go home and, like, you know, just. Yeah, I got into home already with a girl that was 300 pounds. <laughs> Bruh. Now I'm saying, would you not just like sort yourself out and like just do your oh, thing? a quick little talk? Yeah, yeah, ah, yeah. Listen, you know, that's, that's preseason during the week. Uh, <laughs> that's training for the, for the weekend. You know what I mean? Well, <laughs> what, did you do that often? Ah, uh, uh, stop. Ah, she was something else though. She was already. Oh, what? Well, did you do that often though? Huh? Did you do that often? No, no, no. I'm in a relationship now. I'm calm. Yeah, fair, I'm calm. Fair, Fuck fair. that. I'm Jimmy, I'm Jimmy, I don't need to do that now. I, I, I'll show you who follows my now, you know what I mean? Since we're a clown, you know what I mean, bro? I don't need to do that now. But anyways, I wanted to ask you, bro, that's why I listened to the bar, I said, right, let me do a little bit of fucking research. Yeah, yeah. Right? I said, right, I'm not going to go look for his old songs, I'm going to listen to the recent one. I listened, and I, one bar you said, no, obviously, I didn't take it down, but it was like, obviously, your dad not being missing, your mom being missing. Yeah? It was like, uh, mm. daddy never left, kind of sad that my mom did. Yeah, so that's deep, because usually... Like, yeah, yeah, it's the other way around, yeah. isn't it? It's usually yeah, the other way yeah, around. Yeah. It's like black fathers, this, 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 yeah. that, and that, blah, blah. How has that impacted you in your life and stuff? And what's the relationship like now? Now, listen, you don't have to answer that. No, no, I will. But I just obviously, it's, if I speak, this is what we no, talk obviously, about. obviously, like, I still speak to my man and stuff like that. Like, she used to live with me. We just don't stay together no more. Mm. But, uh, yeah, it was a bit tough because, obviously, I didn't really understand, like, you know, like, like, I'd be finding everything cringy because I'm not used to, like, a girl, like, hugging me and, like, okay. trying to talk about this and that because I didn't really get that. Yeah. So, like, obviously, girls that I'd be talking to, they'd be getting mad, like, why is everything so cringy to you? But, like, I don't know. I just find, like, I get Never a weird... that love from home. Yeah, you get me, so love and then, yeah, I, I yeah. get a weird feeling when they're trying to talk about, like... Like, I've never been on a date till this day. Like, I'm talking about, like, dress up and we go to dinner. Even now? Yeah, till this day. Why? It's yeah. just not me. I don't know how to explain like it. That. I, that's just how I am. That's like, actually that. how he So when you're trying to a girl, like what? You just... Nah, like she can come over, watch a movie, order food. Like I'm more of a homebody. Like I don't... Ah, there's not no, enough. Do you know, know what it is? Do you know what it is? We can still do activities. <laughs> we there's can not enough. chill out. <laughs> not even like that. There's not, enough, there's not enough lover boys these days. I'm, yeah, I actually am a lover boy. Though. I feel like you, they're all trying you're to hide You're not bringing a girl on a date. You're trying to hide it. Do you buy girls flowers? You're taking too long. Bro, you're not a lover boy. You don't boy girls the flower, you're not a lover boy, bro. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, he's trying to hide it. Even you probably hide that you're a lover boy. Everyone's trying to hide that. I'm not hiding it though. Would you hide that you're a lover boy? I am. Do you know do you know what the listen, uh, this is what I will say, right? Because I don't people like especially like at home, I promise not to talk about my relationships and all this because I'm getting in trouble. So some of the things that I say, I do get in trouble. Mm. I do get in trouble, like, but this is what I will say, right? Because we're on the topic. Me, the problem I'm having now is that maybe I'm too much of a lover. Maybe I should be like him. Cause I'm not getting that same energy back. You get me? Usually girls are soft and blah blah. I am a fucking lover boy. My my love language is physical touch. Now it doesn't have to be. You don't have to see my book. Touch the private. You don't have to do that. You don't have to grab me. Just like hold me. Yeah yeah yeah. You know what I mean? Hold me. You know what I mean? Let me snuggle in here. You know what I mean? Like why are you on your phone? Come over here. I put your leg on me or something. That's me. I am a lover boy. What are you talking about? No secret. Yeah. That's good. Flowers, People date say, nights. I'm all I'm all that. You know what I mean? Massages. Is come on like see my book. On the sly, you're a lover boy. Like I'm I feel saying like that I am though. He's saying I'm not. I'm saying I am. It's because he took too long to answer the question. No, but it's like, bro. You, bro no, but I am. Doesn't buy flowers and bring yeah, girls on dates no. in my own way. But like, that's that's your way, way. So what? What? Okay, so so what, what, what is? What is? What is tell, tell me something that is lover boy to you. Like what? Yeah, what like do you do? How? How do you what do you show? do? Would you compliment her? Would you like, like see like in Portugal? Yeah. Mm. Like all the boys. Oh, like, when you didn't text you back. Chill, chill, chill. Go on, go on. But I see in Portugal. Yeah. Obviously, all the boys they're doing their own thing. But when I meet a girl, I can't just be like, oh, yeah, let's just have sex. That's it. Like, like, if they walk by my room, they'll hear me talking to the girl. Do you know what I'm trying to say? I'm yeah. not, like, actually, like, having sex with her. I'm actually getting to know her. So build or play. Yeah, but I, I still <laughs> might not, like, I still might not have sex with her, though, because that's not really me. Like, yeah, overseas, yeah, yeah. you don't know where girls have been. Mm. But that man would be more like, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I'm more like, okay, let's talk. Like, tell me about your life. Like, I'm more of a deep person. Okay. So that's what I mean. Like, right. I'm a lover boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to know you. Care about that feelings. Like, yeah, 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 I want to yeah, know yeah. you. Okay. Yes. He ate that up. With yeah, no, he did. He, he did. No, 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 he recovered. He recovered. No. He recovered. Yeah, that, that's, that's like me too. It's like, I'm like you. Build or play too. That's, well, I think that's a hindrance to me. Because mm. a certain man that do the long ball, they're in. Do you get me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do, sometimes I do too much build up. 
Yeah, and yeah, so, yeah, yeah. And the yeah, girl yeah, now yeah, thinks yeah, I'm yeah. your friend. That's why a lot of my female friends are flopped. Too much build up play. Now, nah, but I was... you come to because once a silly lie. Once a guy, <laughs> now once a guy, yeah, is chatting to you and they're giving you brethren vibes, you're not gonna but go see that what guy. he just explained. There, that's dangerous. Then oh, that, that build up play, like that, the way he's doing it is like that's actually. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. But so you don't like the tiki taka? Yeah, I still, no, though, like, <laughs> I still keep it real though. I still keep it real though. I'll tell them what it is though. I'll tell mm. them like, okay, I'm not looking for a relationship or whatever. Yeah, yeah. I'll tell them exactly what I want at the start. Mm. If you want to go with that, then we go with that. If you don't, it's cool. Okay. Simple. You know. Nah, he's I, eating. I can't lie. He is eating. Oh, simple. Yeah. Like nah, yeah, no, you're eating, bro. That's How are you, Celine? How are you? Like when guys move, like, are you? Are you? Like, why are you? Like, let me ask. Oh, this is so fucking bad, but let me ask anyways. How? Like, why are you like ex when guys are moving to you? Oh, that? oh ex. Yeah, yeah, chat to me. Cause you said you have a lot to say. Loba, Here talk. Okay, my ex when it comes to okay, so I basically I don't like when I can't believe I'm not gonna. Talk to you, <laughs> no, but, say talk, talk. Um, ex when it. Can you give me like? Same with, no, so so a guy's moving to you in a club or whatever, yeah? yeah. Or DMs or whatever. What are some of the things you're like? Oh, get away me. And what what will be like entice you to be like? Well, you're gonna give this guy a chance. Okay, well, first, one, an ick, what a boy shouldn't do is do too much, mm-hmm. especially in the club. Don't do too much. All of that, like, but ba- 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 say, oh, be zoo. like, they're giving you kisses. Give you a kiss. Yeah, I don't think niggas, niggas, means, yeah. niggas, yeah. niggas don't kiss in the club, though. I don't really, I don't see niggas yeah, kissing in the club. See, I think you're, no, like, that's niggas, wild. That's niggas wild. don't kiss in the club. No, 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 that's like, really when I'm saying kiss, I'm talking about, like, coming on to you in a way, like, in that way, if you get what I'm trying to say, like, they're not coming to you on a build-up thing the way it is would be doing, do you get me? Like, when they're doing too much, you know, well, see, wait, see the build-up thing though. How did you get them into the room in the first place? Chat to them in the club. Mm, like, so if a nigga, a nigga comes to you, or he's like, because this is what niggas normally say. Mm. Yeah, look, what you doing? Why you doing other? And you're like, yeah, Jamie. Yeah, yeah, so what about that? Would that not give you like? What yeah, you mean? That, well, that's overseas though. I wouldn't do that in Ireland. Like, <laughs> yeah. Ireland. Yeah. Yeah. International. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure, here girls move way bougie than a girl would. Oh yeah, Irish girls. Yeah, Irish girls. I don't are bougie even get it though. Like, Irish girls are bougie as fuck. Well. Really Irish it. girls are bougie yeah, as fuck. Well. Yeah, we're eating it. UK though. girls are more Sorry. open to a mad thing, but Irish yeah, girls. Okay. Irish girls don't do graft. Don't do it. Yeah, you do. Irish girls you have to graft, exactly. bro. Exactly. This is James Milner walk rate. As you should, Fuck though. Fuck that. As you should. Yeah, I'm sorry, As you should, bro. no, but that's an ick when they're doing too much in the mm. club. Like, boy. Mm. Yeah, that's, cr- that's crazy. It's crazy, dog. That's crazy. crazy. But do, do you know what it is, though? What, what, what I find, I, f- I think, for me anyways, people, my, my age group, the girls are just looking to settle down now. They're done with all that. I feel like you, your age, I know, like we were talking about in Apple earlier. Oh, man. Uh, you know, my first, 19 my to first, 24, my first question they are before, moving crazy. I'm no, not even trying to think about that, no, bro. Like, Brother! Nah, my first question before I speak to 19 to 24? Is, did you go to Ayanapa in 2020? Brother! Like, I'm sorry, no. Listen, <laughs> I'm hearing man are getting... Bro, bro the, it's crazy, There's Simbali book outside, bathrooms. English. There's, there's... English. They'll know what Simbali <laughs> what Simbali book is. There's man getting blade and it's, 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 yeah, it's a mad world out there. But listen, let, let me, let me, I have two more sections and then what I'll do, what I do is, right, so we have a meme section where we react to memes. I have two little good ones. We can get a conversation about that. You know, I'll have one question only, which is like, you guys get to ask me a question. You can ask me anything you want. Yeah. And then you just, yeah, loving how I have to look, answer. Loving how he's, I know you're looking at me like that because of the questions I was asking you yesterday. No, don't, 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 it can be deep. It can be funny. It can be whatever. Yeah. Right. But I want to ask you this uh, question about, um, Music wise, so what I, what I like to see from artists now, I'm not a music guy like that too tough, but what I do like to see from artists is like eventually start doing shows, start dropping projects. So what what where is your end goal with music for 2023? What are you man trying to do? I know you did the bar testing, but are you yeah. looking at EPs? Are you looking at doing some little local shows? What, what are you looking at doing? Me personally, I'm just trying to stay consistent. Okay, that's always been my problem. Mm. We start from there and we see where it goes. Mm. Straight like that. I know, but you're gonna get like a like a mixtape off you soon, or anything like next year, or you see everyone's plan. just doing the mixtape thing, but I don't I don't think they're actually thinking about what they're doing. They're just like talk to me about that because I hear that a lot. Ireland, people like, literally drop music for the sake of it. People I'm say real, I'm being real in Ireland, mm. like everyone just kind of copies each other. Like you see one man doing a mixtape or an EP, now everyone wants to drop a mixtape or an EP. Mm. But with me, like if my mind isn't there yet, I'm not gonna force myself mm. to drop a mixtape or an EP. Mm. But yeah, I don't know when that will come. It's just whenever the time is right. Mm. So what's your 2023 looking at like then? It's just just walking consistency, like consistency yeah. and then just learning about the game more. Mm-hmm. That's the main thing. Mm-hmm. Research, like you said. Yeah, oh, definitely, okay. bro. You have it's for me. I don't remember me and Dave and Smiley were arguing here a couple of years ago. Smiley was saying, "No, you don't. No, yes, you do. You do. You do. You, to get to the very top, it's like 
know the game, bro. Do you know what I mean? Know, know what, like you said, know what your purpose is. Know the game. Study other people. What's he doing? And what? How can I tweak that? How can I get to the top? And then study great people. That's all. That's the only way you're gonna learn. That's how I'm learning every day. Do you get me? And studying greats. Um, what about you, Celine? What's what's your twenty twenty looking at? What are we looking at? I'm trying to look at what I haven't been doing. That what I can do. Yeah. You get me? Mm. That's literally what I'm trying to do right now. That's my main focus. Looking at what I've been lacking in. Like, what am I lacking in that I can do better? Mm. Make myself better. Mm. Bring out the best out of Celine type of vibe. That's where I'm going right now. I'm not really looking at no mixtape or EP right now. Same way it is. Like, whatever comes, comes. But yeah, I'm really trying to find Celine. Do you get me? Mm. Before I start doing this and doing that. Because, like he said, everyone is copying each other. When you copy people's paths too much, you're losing your own. Yeah. Do you get me? Mm. So... You have to stay, yeah, that's true. You have to, even though, like I said, I do watch my period, I watch all of them. All of them are doing the podcast game, content game. But it's like, I look at the moment. Yeah, but you're doing something different. No, no, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm, You have to be stay unique to you. Exactly, that's why you're saying if, 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 if my conversations doing, are about getting same. to know people's stories, yeah. if I'm going to speak about my own life to motivate someone else, because I'm not speaking about my own life to tell you about, about my L's. I think someone said to me before, I, I would never tell my L's online. I'm different. I'm like, yeah, I will, because... I'm working towards getting out of it. Because these days, uh, we talked about it earlier, but no mental health, right? Yes, it's a big thing, but I just feel like the so, the people aren't talking about the other side of it as well, where if you work on yourself, you can't get out of it. Mm. You can't stay in that slump. Yeah. The sun's going to come out the next day. Yeah, life days are going to keep anymore. going on and on and on and on. Are you just going to stay there? Yeah. So that's my job to be like, this is good. He's like, yeah, you may think, yeah, I'm doing well. I'm meeting all these people, getting all these views and getting all this. I ain't going through a load of madness yeah, through all this. The scenes, no one Do you get me? Know. People don't understand. No, no, no. It's no. fucked. Family issues, relationship issues, ex relationship issues, children, life, just work, life, in life. Yeah. I'm fat. It's mad. Oh. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> it's fucked. Do you know what I mean? Like, right. So it's like, nah, you're going to watch my, my journey. I'll tell you about my journey and then we're going to see the progression and where I'm going to go. And it's going to be like, he went through all that. He brought us on this journey. Look at him now. I can do it. That's a little kid from a council estate, from all the council estates, whether it be Tala, it be Blanche, it be Lucan, it be fucking the flats, everything. Do you know what I mean? Like, mm. So that's why that's why we do what we do. But it's important, like you, like you guys said, stay unique to yourself because everyone is bleeding. Do yeah, staying thing. real to yourself for real. Yeah. So our meme section, right? So I took this off. I take them off just in uh, LA. Is it LA boy or it's LA, LA boy? boy or something? It, usually these, these are funny, but I took the kind of deep ones, right? So I want to get you man's opinion on it. So I'll just read out the meme and we react, yeah? So... I do what I can for people because I wish I had someone like me in my life. Do you guys feel like you guys are like that? Because I'll start first, right? Yeah. I I am like that, but I'm stopping. Mm. I'm stopping for this reason, right? In my life, I feel, and like I said, we're on camera, people are going to watch this. So I don't like, well, be careful what you say because people watch. But I, I, this is me being real. I feel like I, I stick my neck out on the line for people. Anytime someone will post something, or like I'm going through or whatever, I'll be the first one. If I have your number, I'll ring you. What's going on with your life? Do you know what I mean? But I feel like when, when I was going through my shit, it's not it, this, and it, I'm not asking for a David or a, mm. a Ness, because that's another thing that I was doing as well. Oh, you are my mates, where's all my mates? No, these are the people that you do business with, blah, blah. Don't mind, it's your real friends that know you from young, that mm. can go to your house and just open your mum's door and go in. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? They don't do that. So I'm just like, it kind of triggered my mind. It's like, like I said, my biggest, it's not, it's not Kevin Hart, it's not Ronaldo, it's not Mayweather. My biggest motivation is my children. Everything that I'm doing from this content, whatever I'm doing, it's for the angle of my children. I could not give a rat about anyone. Do you get me? Because I'm at a point where it's too much now. Mm. Even now, look, we were talking earlier. What I'm doing here, I'm here, man, from the block. The block, you know, where you're repping talent and all this, but not Brooker, because Brooker always show love to them. Because mm. that's real over there. Always show love to them. That's what I'm, I don't rep talent. I rep Brookfield, yeah? Yeah. I'm here, man, them from the block. <laughs> that were, because when I got with my girl, because obviously my girl, like whatever, people know her, stuff like this, that, and that, have been praying on us to, like, break up. And, oh, and yeah. we have, we have broken up a few. And I said, I was like, no, people have been praying for this. They didn't think we'd last this long. And I'm here, man, that will smile in my face. You know what I mean? And be like, Don't, and I'm, I'm, I'm here, you. Crazy. Do you get me? So it's one of them, it's like, I'm not, I'm not right, I'm not doing this whole, like, because I was like, oh, keep it real. No. Yeah. Look after yourself. How would you man feel about that? Like, do you man do a lot for people as well because you want people to yeah, do it for you? I feel like I do a lot for people, but I'm not doing it in a sense where you have to do it back. Do you get me? That's just how. 
that's just how it should be. Do you get mm. me? Mm. But then just don't be a fool about it. Like yeah, yeah. when you see that's not reciprocated anymore, what are you doing? Like don't mm. be doing too much. Mm. So, yeah. How about you? Is it's just like if you got me, I got you. I don't. I don't think there has to be much more said about it. But see me, I'm like really reserved. Like I'm gonna observe you first before I even step out of my comfort zone with you. Do you know what I mean? Mm. But yeah, I don't stick my neck out for people like that. Mm. Just people I feel like I need to. Mm. That's about it. Yeah. Now there's like, but there are some, <laughs> there are some like people that, you know, I, I won't dog everybody, but there are like, I remember I, I spoke to you about the, look, I'm not, I'm not, not a hating thing, this is just yeah. reality. I'm, I'm gonna, hopefully it comes on, um, Leon, Black and Irish. Obviously the Kieran episode, you've seen the whole body situation. Do you have any thoughts on that, by the way? Because I never spoke to you about it. Oh. Do you have any thoughts on that? Um, not to bring it back up around that, but just while we're here. Well, of course, well, we already, <laughs> Wait, did he, he we said that with you, isn't it? Yeah, it was, was me, bro. Oh. Look, why are you smiling? No, because <laughs> he yeah. loves it. I know. No, I love what? I'm just I'm asking a question. It's a question. Well, we've already established it. that there's bodies in Ireland. We know there's bodies in Ireland, mm. but um, I don't know. Like, I feel like it was blown out of proportion. Do you get me? Like, from the people from, reacting? Yeah, obviously. 100%. Me, yeah, me, me looking in, yeah. I'm just looking at it. Okay, like he said it. Let's move on. Do mm. you get me? Like, it's his opinion. That's his opinion. Like you said, just made that's his opinion. If I was him, I'd be smiling. I can't lie. But for the girls, like, hearing that you're you're listening to it and you're looking you're like what is he saying do you get me mm. but then from another p- point of view you're looking at it like it's a stretch the way everyone's carrying on about it do you get yeah, me definitely. so t- to that point where I was, I was going with this like obviously leon had his opinion and why again before people oh don't go why are you bringing up negative no it's not it was online so we're reacting to it online mm. so obviously he had a go big long paragraph i know he retweeted they had a conversation about it. i put it on snap if i had to put it on insta it would have been mad because I have a lot of soldiers there. It's it's mental. But I got a phone call. Mm. <laughs> I got a phone call off one of the boys. Don't go. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in the square there with me. Son, all top mark me man. So I got to his gaff now. I was like, hey, hey, hey. I was like, hey, calm down, bro. Relax. I'm dealing with it. Handle it. Cause I spoke Wait, him what, on the what phone. What happened though? What? What happened? He's just basically just. I oh, was like, it's misogynistic. Oh, is that why you were going mad on your Instagram story? One yeah, time? I was like, what the fuck? Like, I didn't. And you're even, telling some guy. I never even. I never even prompt the question to him. He just said it. You get me? Okay. He just said it. Like, you know what I mean? Like, so. It was mad, but like you have people that will ride out for you. Like I'm saying, that's people like that will probably ride out for you. But there are people that are like, not, not we're not mates, but like it's like I rate your things. You get me? I rate yeah. what you're doing, and I always give you praise. I've had certain of them on my platform, and it's just like you, you, you like you know what I mean? Like what? I was like, all right, cool. I'm gonna start moving funny now as well. Not funny in the sense of like, you know, I'm gonna snake you up, bro, because that's yeah. that's not what I do. But I'm just gonna just keep winning and keep smiling. Literally, it's more. Well, I know, I know what you wanna say. I'm not even gonna like. I know about you, blah blah. I'm just gonna just keep on winning. Because if you, like I said to you earlier, I'm not, I always say this, right? See this level we're at now. We're all at the same level. Mm. This is where you're getting the love. Where season one, the whole video went viral. Oh, I don't know, you're so funny. Everyone loves you. You start progressing though. And doing this and what you're doing as you're doing that you're looking down yeah, yeah, that's yeah. when the hate comes like that. exactly. that's, that's, what, that's what the hate comes that's, that's when the hate comes but yeah. I'm at Sweet. this level I'm still with you man I got the bus here yeah. what the fucking bus you're still Truth walking on the as, as long as you're not a threat yeah yeah do you get me well, the minute you're yeah. a threat do you get me Literally. so <laughs> I said I'm here when and I'm getting that hate I was like alright cool when you're making noise you'll get you know what I mean you're gonna suffocate one more for you right and then you get to ask me a question and I'll make my little announcement right this one's kind of similar so we'll I don't know where I screenshot this one. Anyways, my problem is I don't think anyone is genuine towards me. I have a hard time thinking I'm actually liked slash loved, whereas friends, family are dating. Then I tend to just shut everybody out and be distant. I feel like this one's for you because you're a really reserved mm, guy. Do you feel like that? I'm reserved, but like that's that's not me though. Yeah. Like, wait, explain. Can you see? Can yeah, you that, 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 yeah, that yeah, was yeah, Shakespeare. Yeah, kind yeah, of. Was it? Yeah. 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 Was good, one, let me I don't know where. Again. I, I was. You know what I was? I was walking as well, so I was stressed out. So I was, this kind of calmed me down. Mm-hmm. My problem is I don't think anyone is genuine towards me. I have a hard time thinking I'm actually liked slash loved. Whether it's friends, family, or dating, then I tend to just shut everybody out and be distant. Yeah, nah, I wouldn't say like um I'd shut everyone out yeah. and be distant, but uh, I probably overthink a bit too much. That's yeah. why I say I probably read into people too much. Yeah, and then I just come up with this whole narrative in my head. I feel like it's good to do that though. But not too much though. Like sometimes just like, I don't know, just take something the way it is. You don't actually have to look into someone and be like, oh, I'm not sure if they're No, genuine. but sometimes I feel like when you don't, when you don't look into someone, like someone that's needed to be looked into in your life, that's when, you know, stuff won't be going the way it's supposed to be going. Yeah, I hear you. that. But at the same me? time, yeah, like if you're looking for something bad, you're going to find something bad. Do you know what I'm trying to say? 
That's why sometimes just yeah, but there shouldn't be anything bad. Nah, like, mm. we're not we're like not perfect debate. though. I like this debate. We're no, not perfect though. So obviously there's gonna bad. like you're gonna find like some holes and stuff like that. I just think there's some things you can just like kind of overlook. Yeah, you don't but when need you overlook it, then it'll come back in the yeah. future. I think you're just speaking personally. I don't like like. You know, even trying to hear what I'm saying. Before I came in here, I had a little situation. Yeah, she did. I had a situation. I had a situation. So obviously, when I'm hearing something like this, I'm like, yeah, let him land though. Let him land. No, no, no. Before, before, like, I can't say too much because no, of course, no, no, of course, of course. If I speak, but obviously, like, I feel like you do have to look into some some stuff like deeply because more time when you let it pass i don't know like let me know i can't you know like <laughs> you can speak i won't hey, no, speak hating hating how you just said be careful of what you say like yeah. hating that's so bad you can say whatever no <laughs> like, what's the problem no but no because why are you actually laughing <laughs> <laughs> that's you're funny that's why no, no but you know what I, i'm not, i'm like this i'm like this with people i you have to take people as they are someone's showing you what they are it's up to you now to order be with them or no, I'll go back to Love Island, right? We didn't touch on this girl, Whitney. 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 Mm. I loved Whitney from that jump. We have a Love Island group chat, and people were like, oh, there's Whitney girl, Whitney girl. I was like, yeah, no, I like, eat, I, like, I, was like I was like, let her land. Loving her. And someone was like, oh, don't go. Of course you, you'd like her. I'm drawn to personalities, because they're the realest people. Mm. You're showing me what you are. You're going to be, I have a friend like that, Kev. Kev don't give a shit. Kev don't care about no G Millie. My sister Sophia. Sophia don't care about no G Millie. She'll ring me. What the fuck are you doing? Save me and Mrs. having an argument, and me Mrs. goes off and, and do what she does and rats me, sister. What the fuck are you doing? I'd rather that. Well, you see, you see with Whitney, I, yeah. I wouldn't hate like, someone that just behind your back see, and that. Whitney's that, real. Yeah, you know, that, real, Jamie. Like, yeah. I, I like Whitney, yeah, but people be acting like she can do no wrong. Like keep it. No, real I, well. hear that, I, I hear that. I hear that. I hear that. No, I hear that. Like, I hear that too. Real, do you know what? Like, I hear like, it. So I'm trying to say, like, every little thing, oh, now nah, Whitney at that. Like, yeah. <laughs> no, because it's giving. No, it's giving. No, no, it's giving. She, yeah, yeah. Up, though, she came there and she's serving. Like, no, but I hear what you're saying, though. Well, yeah. she's human. Because last night, okay, like, you watched last night. Yeah, what she's she done really, to Zach? Zach. Like, come on, It was man. a bit mad. Zach should have told her to shut up, though. Yeah, yeah. Fair, Zach should have done that. Fair, fair, but fair, it was fair. a bit mad. Zach had everywhere to go mad. It was, like. Yeah. And like, I feel like she done that just because, like, Zach wasn't really feeling her, though. But that's just me, innit? Zach not feeling Molly. Uh, no, nah, Whitney, like, remember when she was trying to, like, oh, chat to yeah, That's why okay. I felt like there was okay. a bit. But nobody wants to talk about that, though. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, Personally, cool. I still feel like she's eaten up. Yeah, yeah, nah, I rate no, I rate her. No, 100%. She's a real one. What I'm saying is, like, see, even someone like like me, even, like, right? For me, like I said before, you have to take, if, I, if I'm showing you who I am, as if, like, not, not to tilt me on home, but, like, I, I speak my mind, yeah? Mm -hmm. Judge me off that. Don't judge me off, like, oh, you're a bit of a prick. Like, just for me, he's a real guy. That's what I'd look. I'd fight. I'd fight for people. You get me? Probably right out, and I've done that. But I'm not doing that anymore because it gets me in a lot of trouble. It gets me in a lot of trouble. Not worth it. I won't no, it's, like, it's actually not. So, like no. I said, stay on the grind, play the game, and see where this thing gets me. So, but anyways, fantastic conversation. I've enjoyed that. Yeah. Um, actually, before I move on to the one question, the football. Yeah. Baller, I'll give you your praise. Appreciate you it. You balled out that day. Appreciate what did you take? So you, you man won that day, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, we did. You man won. So how did you? How would you think of the day as a whole, the actually, tournament, how it was all going to be? I'll be so real, like, like, it was actually a sick day. Mm -hmm. I actually didn't think it was, I didn't think people were going to be watching like that. Like, I just thought I'm just playing a bit of ball. Mm. But I won't lie, like, when you're actually in the cages, like, the pressure actually gets to you. Like, it's actually oh. not a joke thing no more. Like, Better. it's real. David, you remember the loudest, the loudest, what was the loudest noise you heard that day? Or when you got bodied in the cage. Yeah, I, think, <laughs> yeah, I remember. I when humble. Do you know what was, right? You bodied me, I was like, oh, shit. But then I heard the cage, man. I said, get up, get up, get up. Because camera's not all around, you know what I mean? Like, but did you not even try to like, move away from it? Like, no, no, do you know what it was? Because B, you know, B, me and B are friends. Okay. He's like a little bro. I've carried him when he was a baby, right? Mm. So as I'm getting the ball, I'm trying to do step overs, yeah? Remember, you try to do step overs on me and I'm, <laughs> I'm broke. I'm okay, broke. Okay. I'm broke. I'm broke. I'm broke. I'm trying to do step overs, right? Yeah. So I'm trying to do step But B, B's like, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? So he's get. I didn't, I didn't expect that from B. Oh, was he saying this as yeah, you're playing? I didn't expect trash talk from him. I expected from everyone else, but not him. So it kind of like threw me off. But by the time I'm like, I'm thinking, I'm like, boom, straight into the cage. Oh. Done, you get me? And then even like, my team didn't win. Zero goals, zero wins, no all that. How did I make you feel? I slag, how did I make you feel? No, do you know what? I felt good. Have you seen me call myself the biggest star in Ireland? Uh, in Dublin, bitch. in Dublin. The biggest star in Dublin. I realized that day, my name, my name carries weight. Oh. Everyone was giving me stick that day. Me. Not my team, where players were taking a touch, hitting off their knees, and going back to Euro goals. You know what I mean? Players wearing shit. Well, like, that's your Play team, though. No, that's my like, team. You're the guy. It's not me. Well, okay, you said you you're gave like me, the main guy. You gave for me that praise. Team, though. You, and he gave me praise, right? Well, like, at the did, end did of the day. Did I play bad? Did I play bad? Nah, you didn't. You Thank you. I was well, like, told. you take responsibility nah, for that team. team. You take you responsibility for that team. My head was gone. I lost my head. I shouldn't have lost my head, though. 
Yeah, I was like, you lost your head, bro. I, I was in Ness. We're going mad at me. They, they even, I'm the captain. They sold me off. Oh, you, oh yeah. I heard about that. I heard about that. Me off. Did you not win any games? Not one game. Damn. That's crazy, though. Because you actually had a good team. Nah, yeah. we, we, we had people in Shingo. Nah, but like, it, it wasn't a bad team. It wasn't. <laughs> we had people in Shingo. On Astro, bro. It, was, it wasn't a bad team. It wasn't well, a bad it's like, team. It's like, there was even one time, like I said, I faced the ball at someone at a counter attack. <laughs> 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 Hey, yo. Uh, listen, um, I want man to laugh, but listen, we're back again. I think this episode is going to be out 7th of August, the way me and David agreed. Um, and that day we're going to play again. So you're going to get your own, you can get your own team now. What is right? it? Yeah, so. I don't know, man. I feel like people are going to be taking it too seriously. I don't no, want my not, leg getting broken. No, hardly, bro. But you play, do you, do you feel like you're the player of the tournament? Do you want to play the tournament? Nah, but I thought they were going to do one. And I, yeah, definitely. I won't lie. I'm not even trying to. Be big headed, no, nah, you, you're bald still, yeah. Bald, nah, bald. nah, but Black do you know what? No, do you know what I say though? Mendums, it's for you, bro. I know you're gonna watch, yeah. Mm. The green team should have got rest, they played two games in a row. You got a rest for 15 minutes. I'll be that, so I'll they be, smashed you the first game, they did, yeah. Yeah, but I'll be so real. Like, we had a game plan for them this game, like, oh, yeah, they, oh, I hear it, but they, yeah, yeah, no, no, playing back to back game, I just yeah, back to back. no, 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 I'm not gonna lie. I think that's even the game they beat us when we play back to back. Oh, you're back to back, so yeah. we're back to back to back. We already shit. But back to back is long though, I yeah. can't even lie. And yeah. I did think, I don't think the scoreline would have been that bad mm. if they had a rest, but like, uh, it was always, it was yeah, always no, what, be what, like, what I'll do this, are you, are you gonna play this or because girls can play, no? <sighs> I don't know. Like I'm more should, of a, I'm more should, of a cheerleader, you know. Come cheerleader, come cheerlead. on. Yeah, yeah, come cheerlead. Cheerlead. You should get cheerleader. This time what I'll do is though, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep it simple a bit because I was doing too much dribbling. I didn't trust my teammates. Mm. I was doing too much dribbling. Obviously, Ness, I know you're gonna watch as well. Well done. She was good, yeah. Call, to be fair, I was called bald. Well, I feel like I was trying to get the like ball too more and I lost my head, but I was going mad at my teammates where it's like then I was like, this is a fucking charity, you know, mad, you know what I mean? Like yeah. this fucking charity. There was even one time Ness broke someone up. I just went to apologize to the guy going, I leave him there. <laughs> what? <Bro. laughs> I fucking charity. But well, anyways, we'll so get to the... Imagine what's going to be the next time around, bro. Because like, people don't want to lose. Like, nobody's going to want to lose. Like, it's going to yeah, be way more physical, bro. It, it sounds deep. Bro, I'm not even a dense guy I deserve like to... Either, get, like, nah, the way they cook deep. me. Nah. It sounds deep. Brother. Anyways. It's too deep for my liking, bro. One question only where <laughs> you guys get to ask me a question. So we'll start off with you, Celine, as the lady in the no, house. Start, start off with you. You want to start with it? Is, yeah. So you can ask me a question. Uh, anything you want to ask me, and I have to answer it. So when you started doing, like, just like influence and stuff like mm. all of this. Like what changed for you? Like what made you be like, okay, I'm going to take it to the next step? Because everyone has that moment, you know mm. what I mean? So what was, if you want to speak about it, what was like a specific moment that made you be like, okay, it's, it's goal time. You know what I'm trying to say? I, I think it was one of the first times when, it was Tree Arena. Tree Arena? Tree Arena. Like this was, recent one there? No, no, no. Oh. It was Born a Boy, Paddy's Day. Oh, I remember. I was, that, yeah. I was, that was a crazy I day. Was I was there, know. and it was like, cause I see, the studio wasn't the way it is now. It was got renovated, yeah. like you know. And I was, I wasn't recording, and I was snapping at Smiley. Like I said, we always bump heads. Smiley, the way he stuck from, stuck at me. I know he believes in me because the stick that I give this guy, but it's what comes with me because I demand a high level, a high standard. You know what I mean? Yeah. And then um, it was like I felt like my name was kind of like I was just I did one season, I was just going away, but then I went to the arena, bro. I was like. Like, people can ask, I always say that people can ask Amelia this, they can ask JJ this, people have been tree arena, they can ask Amy this. When I'm there, bro, it's like, can I get a picture? Can I get this? Can I get this? Like, you're making, and it's not just black people, yeah. it's black and white people mm. asking for pictures and all because of what you do for an hour on a weekly basis. You get what I'm trying to say? Even I'll give you a quick story. This is a couple of weeks ago. This is in uh, Stevens Green because I walk in Stevens Green. Yeah. So I'm quoting true, and one black fella see me, and he was like, Dong, I'm, I walk by him. He saw me, I walk by him. He's like, Dong, go. Yeah, what's up? He's like, oh, he's like, you saw a fucking Ronaldo or something. Bro, black fella to do that as well is crazy. Did you get me? Yeah, you think crazy. wedge guy as well. Like, oh. That's crazy. I was, like, I was like, yeah, of course. He's like, he's shaking, like, you know what I mean? I was just like, what the fuck? Like, this, it's mad. Yeah. And look, like, even me, I feel like, yeah, that's all good. But I'm not, I'm not looking at that as like, oh, I'm made in it. I'm better than anybody. I'm not better than no one. But it's like, it well, shows you what you can do. Yeah, though. it shows you what you can do. It's like, and that's why it makes me want to go harder. Do you know what I mean? Like, it's just like, and it was one morning as well, to answer your question. I drop my kids off to my ma's in the mornings because she herself walks at like six. So I have to drop the kids off in the morning to my ma's so I can go to work as well. Yeah. I saw my ma going to get to Lewis at half six in the morning. And that from that day, it's just a lit some, even though I'm going through some shit, but it's like a lit a fire in me. It's like, I need to go hard. I don't want to be seeing my ma down there. Do you get me? Yeah. My fourth son. And this game here, I'm, I was watching a video with Young Philly yesterday. 
he's getting his car wrapped and he's talking about coming from humble beginnings. It can happen. Do you get me? Yeah. Even though in Ireland they don't believe in it, blah, 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 and people put you down and people are like, oh, this, 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 that. Mm-hmm. See this content game, this internet game. If you click and do it right, you can change. And see, the good thing about Ireland, world, yeah, you, know? you can actually be like the first to do things here. That's yeah. what people don't deep like. Yeah. That's why I don't mind. Like, I think Ireland is a sick spot. No, it, it's coming, even with the music, it's healthy. I, I like where the scene is at. It's nice. healthy. Do you get me? I like where people are doing that. And even um, Aston said this to me the other day. Um, he was like, he loves the way we're all here because now artists like yourselves can do media runs. Yeah. Back in the day, you didn't have that. You had yeah. share my music on Snapchat. And that mean? was it. That was yeah. it. Now you, you, people can do media runs. You can go to Where's Your Head At? You can go to Charge It. You can go to Ness. You can go to fucking, let me not leave out, uh, GTG. Yeah. You can go, and there's other ones coming up. Sharon's going down on a podcast. There's other, lot of people doing a podcast. Yeah. You can go do your media run now. You get me? And promote yourself properly. Do you know what I mean? Like, and be able to listen to parties. It's great. There's, there's, it's great. Yeah, do you know what yeah. I mean? So yeah, so to answer your question, yeah, it's just it's just like that moment there, looking at my man, it's like half six in the morning. I'm like, you should be at home, man, chilling, man, in a in a, in silk Gucci sheets, relaxing with your big vitrine, and your guy with your big ball of jack. It's deep, you know what though. I mean? It's, it's deep. 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 So, so, so so that's it. Celine. So I know you're saying that you're you seen your mum that way is what's making what made you come into this again and. But what actually motivated you to come back? Because I know I sent you a voice note a few a while back when oh, I yeah. seen you post on your story and you're oh. like, you're gonna retire. And I was like, boy, what is that? This guy's so dramatic. Like, yeah, 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 I'm a drama <laughs> queen. <laughs> no, people no but what, 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 made, what motivated you to actually like come back? My peers, let me not lie. Obviously, look, we're in this game, right? And it's like, we're not mates. Mm. I don't, like, you're not, you're not N1, you're not John Tamboy, you're not Amelia, you're not Abs, but you're like, you are my, you, and they do care for me. So that day, Tommy rang me. Tommy was shouting at me. Snowden rang me. Um, in the mandem, Paul, uh, Dub City rang me. He's like, "What the fuck are you doing? Why are you quitting and all like this? That and this is what you're gonna get." Like, you know what I mean? Like, you're not Goody Dongo anymore. You're Dongo Productions. You get me? You have to kind of conduct yourself in a certain way. And I was like, "And these are these are not like man my age. These are YGs. Aston mm-hmm. and Joel. They pull up to the house. What are you doing? What are you talking about retiring off for? You know what I mean? Just, I am a drama queen. I'm a very emotional <laughs> person. But it's like I wear my heart on my sleeve. You know what I mean? I just want like, cause cause I. I don't give a rat. No one has to believe me. Like I said, God, God knows my heart. I don't give a shit. I want everyone to do well. Everyone to win. You get me? But not everyone's like that for me. And that's what bugs the life out of me. It's like, what the fuck did I? What the fuck did I? If I if I ever talk about a situation or whatever, I don't mention anyone by name. Mm. Season one, maybe. I was throwing out names. Da da da. Blah blah. I was, I was not a hating thing, but I was like. I was trying to be like the black messiah and the, the righteous one or whatever. I feel like you're probably just keeping it too real. Like yeah, yeah, I, I was, I was. But no, but look, you're allowed to voice your opinion. Yeah, like, course, you're allowed, what we do, it's kind of journalistic as well. So you're allowed to voice your fucking opinion. You know what I mean? Let's have that right. But it's just like, I feel like sometimes like, I do show a lot of love, I don't get that back. So that's where I just like, yeah, I was like, now I, I understand the game now. You know what I mean? Like, so it's, it's all about, no matter what anyone says, it's all, about, you can network the fuck all you want. The end goal is to look after your family. Mm. No, one, no one else can do that for me. You, they can make it. This, this is the person can make it. They're not going to give my family a euro. No, they shouldn't. So it's up to me to do it. You get me? So, so that's what motivated you? Yeah, yeah, yeah 100%. 100%. It's loving. 100%. So, yeah. yeah. I feel that. Like Appreciate that. That was nice. <laughs> Don't, which question was better, though? Don't lie. I like your question. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Cause I, I, you basically I, I, just I, copied I, my question. Oh, because like, no, I already had, I had that it. question yeah. already. Yeah, like, yeah, I was right. actually going to ask him what motivated him because yeah. he actually came. Yeah. We were so, actually, why didn't you go first then? No, yeah. because I was wanting to see what you're going to say. But hating how you <laughs> took <laughs> that. <laughs> no, hating how you said that. <laughs> but loving, it correlates. Like, well, yeah, yeah you, man, I appreciate you guys coming on. It was last minute, but I feel like this is a very good conversation. Great way to yeah. open up. I love the way you two are so young as well and you're trying to make it in this game. And I look forward to your journey. You have a fan of me and I'll be I'll be rooting you on on your journey. And just to close, boys and girls, special announcement. We have a live show. What do you mean? Show, if I Speak podcast Ooh. has a live show. 22nd of November. Okay. Date is locked and loaded. Contract is signed. Civic Theatre in Tale. It had to be Tale. Yeah, I wasn't doing a live show. Oh. It wasn't Tale. So yeah, Civic Theatre in Tale. Um, tickets will go on sale, I think, the day after this episode. Cause that's when I wanted to go on sale when this drops and then tickets will go on sale. All the information will be on my page. I'll be promoting it, all that type of stuff. But yeah, come out, support your boy. We're gonna have acts. We're gonna have guests. We're gonna have. It's gonna be a mad nah, team. So, yeah. So I, I told you last night. I was like, yeah, yeah you're gonna be there for the announcement. So yeah. So live show. If I speak, I'm looking forward to it. Um, I feel like this is gonna be kind of like me cementing my place in the content game. So so yeah, Civic the live show. I want to see you guys there. Madame Tama, I want to see you there as well. 100%. 100%. 100%. I'm there, bro.
I appreciate it. I appreciate you guys. Thank you for watching, guys. Like, share, subscribe, all that bollocks. Spotify. Go with that Spotify and share as well. Yeah, appreciate yeah. you guys. Love. <laughs>